immediately. So get back here on the double. Let's do it. I can't wait to take these seps down once and for all. Yeah, dude. You Fuck the seps. Jorgen out. I, I never really cared for them. I mean, I get. I mean. They do have those fucking Roger Roger guys, which I absolutely adore. And you know, it's really funny, like calling them clankers, but you know. Like, clankers is really, really funny. They're, the Separatists are good for memes. I like their memes. So I gotta go up there, and I can get up there from here. Okay. Greetings. You are cleared for the following travel routes. Okay. Be safe out there. Yeah, I am noticing um, some lag on my screen. I hope the stream doesn't pick up any lag, though. That'd suck. But like, uh, like right there, like that was like, a tiny bit laggy, which it wouldn't have been off stream. But uh, I'm pretty sure it's something to do with the CPU and the GPU of uh, computers. Okay, I don't think that's me, but holy crap, that guy right there was like 20 frames a fucking second. That was weird though. Um, no, nah, but uh, I don't know. I think it's something to do with the CPU and the GPU. Like, while you're on stream, it goes ahead and uh, uses some of it so you lag like a little bit. Whoa, whoa, not so fast, Sergeant. You and me need to have a little talk. I'm Lieutenant Verk. I think maybe you heard of me. See, my boys here saw you having a chat with little Ensign Farn. I know Farn told you about my business, and I know you went and blabbed about it to some very important people. Oh! And now, I got a mountain of paperwork to do, hearings to go to, people asking questions, and I don't like that. Okay, so let me explain this. Uh, when I was off stream, uh, like I first tried this game out, um... Like a couple missions ago, uh, this one guy came up to me saying that uh, this guy right here, Lieutenant Berg, was engaging in some like illegal business. I think he was trying to smuggle or some sort of stuff like that. I can't remember it exactly, but he was basically doing illegal crap. And as you can tell, this guy's obviously an asshole. And so this one um, normal squad soldier guy, like newbie, uh, came up to me and told me about it because apparently his friend tried talking about it, but uh, his friend went missing. And most likely this guy killed his, like, this dude's friend, and basically this guy's an asshole and he's doing illegal stuff. And so I went ahead and told my uh, captain about it. Obviously, you know, because, I mean, yeah, you know, tattletale, whatever. But to be fair, this guy literally killed people and is doing illegal business. So, you know, I, I don't really feel bad for reporting it. You know, I'm being a, I'm being a good guy here. So, yeah. Yeah. You're extorting your own men, Ferk. No, I have one person to blame for these problems. You. Wise up. This island is my little kingdom. I can make sure people live, and I can make sure they die. So you better believe that I'm going to make extra sure you come home from your next assignment in a box, Sergeant. Yeah, uh... As you can tell, this guy's an asshole. Don't try to scare me. You don't have to be scared for accidents to happen. I think we're done here, boys. Let's move out. Yeah, fuck this guy. He's a piece of shit. I don't like him at all. Ah, oh, Sergeant. Welcome back. Grab yourself a seat. You're gonna be observing the op here with me. I take it the rest of my squad is already in the field? Havoc Squad is infiltrating the Separatist stronghold to retrieve the ZR-57 as we speak. Commander Tavis was very clear. Under no circumstances can I send you in to join Havoc on this mission. 
I have to admit, I'm a little surprised. I honestly thought you were starting to come along, but I guess Tavis still isn't convinced you're ready for the big time. Mm, I I don't really like any of these options, you know. I don't want to be like a dick or anything, but at the same time, though, I think I could very well go in that damn field and I'd be amazing at it. That's weird. I trust Commander Tavis's judgment. Maybe next time, Sergeant. I'm sure. Lieutenant, sir, we've got a situation here. Talk to me, Ensign. What's going on? We've lost contact with Havoc Squad, sir. Comms, video locators, everything. It's like they disappeared completely. That's unacceptable, soldier. You get back to that terminal and you get me Havoc status now. Yes, sir. Send me in, Lieutenant. They may need assistance. Could be breaking Tavis's orders, but if it comes to that. Still no signal from Havoc Squad, sir. I think we may have lost them. All right, listen up, people. This mission will not fail on my watch. We are not going to let that bomb get away again. Infiltrating that stronghold is a mission only Havoc Squad can pull off. Lucky for us, we have one Havoc Trooper left. Sergeant, you're going in there. CR-57 must not remain in Separatist hands. Is that clear, Sergeant? Affirmative, yeah. Hell yeah, yes, dude. Sir. We were hoping to get the bomb back intact. We're way south of a best-case scenario here. So here's the new plan. We have the activation code for the ZR-57. We disarm the bomb, leaving the SEPs with nothing but a big radioactive paperweight. You'll have to hijack the Separatists' comm system to broadcast the code. This data spike should do the trick. I never thought it'd come to this, Sergeant. I don't need to tell you what happens if you don't pull this off. Fucking count on me, guy. I've never failed a mission before, and I'm not gonna start today. That's what I like to hear. You have the coordinates for the Separatist stronghold. I'm sure you can guess how much security they're likely to have. Reach the perimeter, use the data spike on the comm terminal, and shut the ZR-57 down for good. Thousands of lives are on the line, Sergeant. We're counting on you. Good luck, Sergeant. Thanks, sir. Okay. Um, just a quick little thing. This guy was kind of an asshole when I first started playing the game, and I was like, you know, like a new sergeant, and uh, now he's starting to come around. I think that he's just hard on new recruits, and maybe takes some, uh, Maybe he uh, just doesn't like instantly trust or anything, but now he was kind of a dick at first, but I'm starting to like him. I'm starting to like the guy. He's not half bad. But I got some new stuff here. So, real quick. I mean, it is kind of like along that way. I am going to run on down to the market and try to clear out some of my inventory. I have a lot of extra random bull crap here in my inventory that I don't want anymore. See if I can get rid of some of it at all. Best post exchange around. So, we got yeah, sell, sell. Oh, that's cool. Sell, can't sell. Oh, oh, it doesn't have any value. So. Some of this crap that I can't even sell, though. Be sold to a vendor. I want to be able to just get rid of some of this crap in my inventory. Like, maybe I could dismantle like, some of the stuff. It doesn't even ha it doesn't give me any credit, so I can't sell it to like a vendor. I just, I want to get rid of some of it, like, Good luck wonder if there. maybe I can, like, I mean, that's a decent amount of, like, free slots, but no, there's, like, a lot of extra, like, crap here that I don't need, like, whatsoever. Like, a lot, of, most of this right here, like, all this armor here is all garbage stuff that I don't want anymore. Okay, so I wonder if I can go ahead and take one of those uh, speedsters to uh, bring me closer to like the mission. Greetings, you are cleared for the following yeah, travel. Yeah, I can. Nice. <sighs> That's cool. After this mission, I'll uh, stop streaming though. So I do want to view parts of my stream, make sure it actually did come out decent. 
maybe tweak around what I can to make it a bit better. I have noticed there's a lot of pop-ins on screen. I, tr I mess tried messing around the settings when I first started playing the game. And no, nah, this is like max. I think it's just because this is like a bit of an older game. Pop-ins are just kind of like inevitable, I guess. I just do hope my stream quality is not half so bad. You are fit for duty. Return to your post. Yes, sir. So, oh crap! No way! Did I really just go so fucking far away? Oh my god! No way! I could have sworn I was supposed to go this way. No, I totally went the right way. No shot. This has got to be like the closest I can get to it. I hope so. Hope I didn't just like go extremely far way off course. Like, what's that all the way over there? It's a pretty strong one. Oh, um, I think the speedster that I used was connecting to a different place, maybe? I'm not fully sure. I don't know. I'm not very familiar with how this game works. I'm still very new. You see, I could also like live stream some uh, Guild Wars 2, because I've played over 60 hours of that uh, MMO. I do some PvP in it. The only uh, thing is, um, because I'm so like familiar with Guild Wars 2 and I've played a decent amount of the game, I uh, am afraid that like. If anybody sees it and they don't fully understand how the game works, it'd be really confusing because they don't know the game from like the start. Yeah, I totally just screwed that up. I want the I want a totally like wrong way. I, I'm I'm so confused here. Um Yeah, I, I went totally off course there. Damn, this is uh, not a very good streaming game, is it? Like, it doesn't really seem like this game is great to uh, live stream. Wow. Yeah. Okay. I I did. I just just go in a. I just. Wow. Okay. Um. Let's not do that again. So, why did it tell me I could go over there? I'm pretty sure it told me that I can go over there. So I'm supposed to go this way. What the hell just happened? Okay, I guess. Whatever. Screw it. That was badass. The guy had a lightsaber. I actually am pretty excited to start up a Sith character as well. That character I'll probably stream from like the very, very beginning. Oh, that's just, oh, that was nice. This is a nice area. I liked it. So, yeah, I can just go right over there. Perfect. Nice. Sweet. Oh, dude, this game is so fucking sick. Look at that. Straight lava, that's badass. I have yet to die in this game. This game does feel very, very easy, which is not a bad thing. It's a pretty, like, casual game. I wonder if anybody else is like, I wonder, oh well, not anybody else, of course there's obviously people, but I wonder how many people are streaming this game right now. Uh, I have, um, I've like seen some uh, gameplay for the new uh, Jedi game, it's a uh, Jedi Survivor, you know, it's a sequel to like Jedi Fallen Order. I saw some gameplay on it and uh, I wasn't a big fan of Jedi Fallen Order. But like pretty much all the issues that I had with the game seem to have been fixed with the sequel. Like the combat seems like it has a lot of like versatility to it. The uh, 
movement and the flow of it, like the parkour and all that, seem really, really nice. And uh, there's actual customization, which Jedi Fallen Order did not have. Uh, I played the game at release, and I quit it, like, I don't know how far I got in the game. I got past, like, an encounter with Darth Vader, from what I, like, remember. And, dude, it just was not that fun of a game. And I did not like the poncho system. I thought that sucked. Like, I thought that was dumb, like, with the ponchos. I don't get why the devs did that. But I saw the customization in uh, Jedi Survivor. It looks really, really nice. It's not a game that I'm going to buy at full price because, um, I don't know, it's not exactly up my alley. But, uh, I do like it. I like the look of it, and you can make Cal actually look pretty awesome. Whoa. Nice. I really like how far away you can loot people. Are these other players? No, they're not. They're they're AI. That's sick though. Just destroy that guy with some AI. That was nice. Ah, you son of a. Ah, okay. Are they just following me? Is that... is that... is that an AI? I don't think it is. I think this guy's name is literally just Galactic Marine. No, I think this is like an actual player. I think it is. Alright. Oh, I need to recharge my gun. Ooh, new ability. No, never mind. I'm done. That was a new ability.